about a 400 point difference as a result of the three pointers made by Caitlin Clark. Robinson count the basket. She'll go to the line. Yeah, Barbara Kennedy Dixon, it is an absolute shame that she's not in the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame. As we see Amari get her uh, eighth point here, that's a great job getting uh, her defender up in the air and then going to the basket and finishing on that three-point play. Marissa Russell picking up the personal foul, and with that, it won't show up in any record books outside, though, of the Robinson household, but within very important moment right there for the daughter who just passed her mom, who was a fabulous player at Providence for the family scoring lead for her career. <laughs> she had matched her with six. Long ago, Amari went way past her dad who played at Notre Dame. I mean, that was pretty much academic, but mom was holding on, holding on, and she just, I'm sure, proudly saw her daughter go past her in career points. Yeah, her mom is in the Providence College Hall of Fame, played for the great Bob Foley up there. And uh, just an outstanding player. Lily Love with her second personal. So we noted Amari moves ahead of mom, now has the family scoring lead in the Swish family Robinson. <laughs> and you see the numbers. And knowing her mom, there's no doubt she is so proud of Amari. And dad too. Dad's proud of her as well. And I'm proud of her. She's an outstanding young lady and a wonderful basketball player. Andrea and Keith, proud of daughter Amari, native of Douglasville, Georgia. What a great career she's had. She's going to go into education. She'll be phenomenal in that. She'll be a teacher. She may have the desire to become an administrator of some kind. She'd do great in that regard, you would think. Well, she, she will have completed her master's degree by the time this year is over.